हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल टेक्स पॉट दिस इज मी हरीश गोपाले सो बेसिकली इन टूडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट हाउ वी कैन इम्प्लीमेंट पॉजिटिव लेवल सेंसिटिविटी लैच बाई यूजिंग टू इज टू वन मार्क्स एंड नेगेटिव लेवल सेंसिटिविटी लैच बाई यूजिंग टू इज टू वन मार्क्स इफ आई टॉक अबाउट वर्किंग एंड फंक्शनलिटी ऑफ पॉजिटिव लेवल सेंसिटिविटी लैच सो इट हैज टू इनपुट्स डी एंड इनेबल एंड वन आउटपुट दैट इज क्यू and functionality says that if uh, input uh, enable is high then the latch will act as a transparent that means q will hold the current value of d or i can say that latch will hold the current value of d similarly when enable is low then it will ignore the uh, d it will ignore the input d and it will hold the previous value of q even truth table also says that if enable is high then whatever the value of d that is either 0 or 1 q will store that value or latch will hold that value but when enable is low then a latch will ignore the current value of d and it will store the previous value of q okay now uh, if i if we try to implement this by using to is to one marks so as we know the working functionality of to is to one marks which uh, which is having two inputs and one select line and one output so based on the select line it will route the inputs to the output now while implementing a positive level sensitivity latch by using to is to one marks here also we are having two inputs input d and input enable so what we will do will select enable as a select line for this to is to one marks and d as a input and q as a output so when enable is high as per the truth table of positive level sensitivity latch when enable is high it will uh, the latch will act as a transparent means output q will store the uh, input value d so we'll connect uh, e, uh, d when when enable is uh, high when enable is low as per the truth table of positive level sensitivity latch it will store the previous value so what we'll do we'll connect q as a input when enable is zero so this is how uh, we can implement positive level sensitivity latch by using two is to one mark now if i talk about working functionality of negative level sensitivity latch so it is the reverse of positive level sensitivity latch that means here when enable is low then only a latch will act as a transparent that means output q will store the current value of d or i can say a latch will hold the current value of d but when enable is high then it will ignore the input d and it will hold the uh, previous value of q okay even truth table also says that when enable is low then the whatever the value of d that is either 0 or 1 q will going to store that value okay and when enable is high then whatever the value of d that will be ignored and q will store the previous value of q okay now if we try to implement this by using two is to one marks so here also we will do the same like uh, we will connect uh will select enable as our select line for two is to one marks and d as the input and q as the output so when enable is low so we'll connect input d because truth table says that when enable is low then d will be then uh, q will store the output value of d means latch will hold the current value of d so here also when enable is low uh, input d will be routed to the output y uh, output q and when enable is high then as per the truth table of uh, negative level sensitivity latch uh, it will hold the previous value so what will connect what will do will connect our output q as a input uh, to the uh, to is to one marks when enable when enable is um, high okay so this is how we have uh, implemented neg um, negative level sensitivity latch by using to is to one marks so here in this video we have implemented positive level sensitivity latch by using to is to one marks and negative level sensitivity latch by using to is to one marks here i will stop the video If you are watching this video then please click on the like button if you are new to this youtube channel then please subscribe to my youtube channel thank you